hey, hello church. It's been a while since we've communicated this way through our V Connect, but I just want to make sure that you know what's on the horizon for us as we meet as a church family. We're going to go back to a one service format. You know, months ago when we were able to come back and meet in the building, we relaunched with two services and the main reason for that was just to keep our numbers at a minimum at each service and maintain some distancing. But with the recent developments that our county is now in a low risk category and the COVID vaccine is more readily available, we feel like it's time for us to move back to some more familiar rhythms and patterns of worship. I'm not going to use the word normal yet because there's still nothing normal about this, but it is getting to be more familiar. So Thursday the 18th will be our last Thursday evening service. And after that, we'll just encourage everybody to come and be part of the Sunday morning service. When you come in, you will see that the room has been reconfigured again. We're going to have to remove the tables. We'll set the chairs in rows, but they will also be in clusters of two or three or five or maybe more. And we're just asking you to choose the seating area that is appropriate for the number of people in your group. So in other words, if you come in as a single or a couple, don't take a row of five. Save that for a family. At the same time, we are going to continue with our online service. Uh, that's something that we will keep throughout and, and probably ongoing. And by the way, I appreciate those who are watching online who just let their presence be known there. I'm encouraged by that. So keep doing that as well. You know, as we make this change, we realize that this isn't the end and, and there are likely more changes coming. Hopefully we will have more and more opportunity to get back to what we knew before, but it's entirely possible that we could go the other direction, that things could blow up again and we have to make more changes. So we're, in a sense, we're just, we're doing what we need to do as we go along. We don't know what the future holds, but we have great confidence in the one who does know. And so we'll just keep uh, fixing our eyes on Jesus, as Hebrews 12 says. He's the author. He's the perfecter of our faith. He's the beginning and the end, the alpha and the omega. Nothing surprises our, our God. And so we're going to keep our eyes fixed there because that's the constant in this whole season. But I want to make, make that known to you. Um, Come back to the one service format. We're looking forward to that. It's just good to be together with the family of God. And we're looking forward to doing that more and more as the opportunity presents itself. Church, I hope that you are well. I trust that you're staying healthy. Look forward to seeing you and hearing from you soon. In the meantime, as I said before, keep your eyes fixed on Jesus.